Hello everyone, I'm Hale from the channel A Hale of the Wheel, and today we are doing another draft. Um, but like I said in my last video, I'm thinking of doing something ridiculous. Um, I'm going to attempt potentially to force a uh, a kingfisher only um, a ki uh, kingfisher deck. Like, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna attempt to legitimately force a entire deck around a freaking common. Yeah, um, just actively seeing if I can get, how many I can get, uh, similar to like, uh, it's an old video, but, um, loading ready one, one still like a, like, we're gonna try to draft as many uh, uh, charging badges as possible. Like, like a charging badge, I can say. I think I've seen king, of the few times I've drafted this format, Kingfishers seemingly like I think I got my hands on like four, and I could have gotten even more kind of things. Um, so. Is it the uh, the best use of a token? Probably not. But I'll see you in just a few minutes when um, my queue actually feels up. See you in just a moment, though. And here we go. Um, Elvon, Renovo, I I get plus one plus one counter. Um, cast the Sinket Spell, mass two orbs. Uh, Evil tempts you. Um, let's go, Elvon. Uh, that always seems to go around quite easily. Um, photo bagness. Whatever. Ring tempts you. Okay. Uh, leaves the battlefield. The ring tempts you. Um, I'm gonna go Golem. I uh, actually, I'm gonna get that in. A Haven's Navigator. Let's see how things go. Oh, there's the first kingfisher. I guess I have to go with that. <laughs> like, yeah, out of everything at the moment, it's it would either be the inhaled in there or the kingfisher. So, yeah. I mean, the if the strands would have been nice, but like I said, force the kingfishers. Is it the best strategy in the world? Oh hell no! But um, and I'm not sh too sh like selecting Elvon probably forced my way, you know. But, um, thought they escape or, um, I'm gonna go with, uh, Alindor, uh, and Frodo was there again, so I'm almost thinking that. Selesnia might be open, potentially. <laughs> Golem, Oko, for Odo and Sam. Snake, oh, look at all these. <sighs> Let's see how this goes. Um, okay, so green is really open, red is really open. Uh, Brandywine Farmer. Uh, 
Let's go. I'm between chance and met elves. I'll revive the Shire. Um, let's go with chance and spire because with Elrond it actually somewhat got things going in that regard. Um, Uh, and just moving tempt you at the begin uh, I've left the battlefield. Yeah, let's try you. Oh, really? <laughs> Big. Um. Attach it to a creature you control and tap it. Um. Let's go with the bow. Um, ring tempts me. And hexproof, the ring tempts me. Um, I'm gonna go with the Bombadil song here. Um, go with another bow. Uh, but a plus one plus one counter on target creature you control if it fall greater it gets uh let's go there let's go there Randy Wine Farmer Revive the Shire. Um, um, I'm almost wanting to take so no one else gets it, but pseudo removal, which is good. Um, I'm gonna go with ba the Balrog, and some other people really don't. So, granted, I realize I'm not facing these people again, but somebody might actually eat me. I had to select the Kingfisher. I realize I'm not really blinking a whole lot, but. Yeah. Uh. Maybe not squaring as much as I would like to get full advantage of that. Um, I'm gonna do the Aaron and we might be able to shift it wide. Um, I'm gonna do the. Hmm, I'm gonna do the bot they saved. The bewitching would have been nothing. Also, hence for removal. Um. I'm gonna be good without that. Um, I'm gonna do the Shire Towers. Out of Rivendell. Um, what I'm gonna do, Elrond, slip on the ring, Lambdis, yeah, I'm gonna do the, uh, it enables some of the scrying mechanics that I have going on. Um, uh, 
I'll take that for now. Uh, hex proof or let's go with another bombardier song. I probably should have like so I can draw, but uh, let's go with the land knots for re more removal. Um. Let's do the lookout for more scrying action. Um, I'm gonna side deck that, but that might be an option for getting into the later sections. Um, I take the brandy wine because that's really not coming into much use. Um, yeah. Uh, so. Um. I'm gonna do the of the lions. I'm gonna probably um on unsummon. I'm gonna do that for the unsummon and the tempting. Not getting as many kingfishes as I was thinking, so. Um, uh, Mana Dark, um, I'm gonna do the potential removal, get rid of removal for somebody else. Um, let's do the gr hey, hey, mutants. navigator again. Now I'm really lacking like things that really benefit from me uh, scrying. So, um, oh. The Wheel of Winds are really good, but I'm gonna go with all win here. Um, actually benefit from some scrying. Um, another all win just in case. Um, yeah, no, Kingfish are in. Uh, actually, let's see what happens in pack number eight, which is on Brink of Bears, but. I may not have a uh, never but yeah um yeah there is no yeah there really is a whole lot of sky uh No amount of the a whole lot of uh, not much in terms of the kingfishers this time around, which is somewhat sad. Unless the meta really has picked up like kingfishers, like actually somewhat good. So yeah. <sighs> Uh, 
2.4, yeah. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, side decking that. Yeah. Main deck that. Let's cut it down. I'll see you in just a moment. Uh, here it goes. Um, I have to cut down at least four cards. Um, let's say goodbye to the shark catch mushrooms. Um, I'm going to take care of one of that. Um, Island cycling, so that's probably going to be fine. I'm going to take out the guard of him. Um, and one more card. Uh, Flash enters the battlefield, yep. Um, let's take out the land disc. And I'll, I'll see y'all in a bit with game number one. See you in a moment, And here we go in game number one against a bunch of letters. Um, I think this is a keepable hand. Um, it's not the best, but. Island pass. Yeah, it's so three speed, which is somewhat sucks. But... Uh, do I want to activate? No. Uh, next turn, I'm gonna forest into you know, the Kingfisher. The following turn, at least. Then. Uh, sink an island. Uh, Nick, I was actually hoping for a sinking island eventually, so. Um. Mm. Uh. See the, yeah, I'm gonna do the bow now. I could get out that, but I'm gonna choose not to. Yes, let's give a thing with flying reach. Uh, let's go with Malindor Swift Savior. Draw mm. oh, card, yes. Uh, Squire one. Yeah. Oh, that's... Bandit, I really don't, like... I'm really not familiar with, like, Lord of the Ring laws, but is... Has anyone ever actually in the books? Oh, oh this is... Uh, I'm just wondering if Elrond was ever actually tempted by the ring or not. Keep that up. Keep that going. Uh...
is gonna talk goodbye you. Uh, to the bottom. Yeah, I'm gonna be fine with this. Reveal. Get out of one to the hand. Uh, put a counter on all win. Oh, that's gay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I was... <laughs> I was on the wrong screen the entire time. Didn't realize that. But yeah, um... I actually think that, uh... I actually think that was a good first game. Granted, we really didn't get to see it. Um, ended the game with six lands. I'm against a very aggressive uh, red-white deck. So I think the deck has legs. But let's see how it goes in the next few games. So see you around, folks.